Snowpiercer. For the first time since the world ended, a brighter future awaits beyond the train. Well, I hear my train is on There are places on the earth that are warming. You will have a say in our destination. And your choice will determine our future. Hope is a slogan, an empty promise. There's only one way, the way I do things. Get back with Wilford. Wait for that train. Or dig a grave with Layton. Wait, there's options? Melanie's sacrifice gave us a map. We find new weed and then we go back for the others. Who the hell is that? My name is Asha. I am a survivor. We still don't get how it's possible to survive eight years out there. There's still hope. It's time to go get our train back. Wilford hates surprises. Let's go give him one. <laughs> Battle stations! Eight of you against the great Mr. Wilford. I'm calling on you to settle this with honor. We'll finish this where we started. Five, four, three, two. We keep everyone as alive as possible. Minus an arm or two. Another day, another near death experience, right? All right. Season three premieres uh, on January 24th on TNT. And as you see on the screen, I'm super excited to have Rowan Blanchard, who plays uh, Alexandra Cavill, Mickey Sumner, who plays Bess Till. Thank you both immensely for your time. I really appreciate it. Thanks for having thank us. Thank you. And oh, happy birthday, Mickey. I, I uh, saw that. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. I really appreciate it. No worries. So for you both, uh, do you have a favorite memory uh, on set uh, from this past season? Uh, Mickey T first. Oh, so many. I think that, um, you know, we've been really talking about how quarantine and COVID really um, forced us all as a cast to sort of bond together and become each other's um, families and therapists. And, you know, that we cried uh, on each other's shoulders and we went to the beach together. And I think, you know, like, yes, I love Snowpierce and I love playing Best Till, but ultimately what I love the most about doing this show is, is, is the rest of the cast and just, just, just beautiful, incredible friendships have been formed. So. I love it. And for you, Rowan, how about you? Do you have a favorite memory as well? Um, what just came to mind was on the last day of filming, we had a sick Nerf gun fight with the whole crew and a water gun fight outside. So that was so fun. Awesome. That sounds amazing. Um, what are you both excited for the most for the fans to see with your characters? Uh, to you, Mickey. Um, you know, I think this season we see Till in a bit in a different role. She's sort of a bit lost. Um, she's not a detective anymore. She's not a brakeman. She's sort of, um, you know, Leighton's right hand and his sort of trusted confidant, but also sort of questioning him and sort of having her own doubts and then sort of exploring more of like a, um, a how do I put it, um, possible romance. <laughs> and how about you, Rowan? Um, for me, it was just getting to see how Alex has, has sort of grown up and grown out of some of these um, dynamics. She's discovering her own voice. She's challenging. Um, obviously, she she challenged Wilford and uh, she, you know, is, is with the with people that she's getting to know. And um, I think she gets to step into her, you know, her young adulthood a lot in this season. And that was really fun to play. Amazing. Well, I love you both. You guys are uh, awesome. I love you on Snowpiercer and all the other work you do. Everybody checking this out. Make sure you tune in to TNT on January 24th when season three premieres. Thank you, Rowan. Thank you, Mickey. Thank you. N nerds rule. Yes. Rule the world. Yes, yes. Love you guys. <laughs>